Hey, what's going on everybody? I'm King Sway and welcome back to Sway Room Games. We are still playing Elden Ring and Brina. Hold on, I'm gonna let this guy talk. How could this be? My daughter deserved better. The fault lies with me. I chose duty over my daughter's safety. And that is how fate has answered. I'll find them. The foul wretch is responsible for this. I'll hunt them down and exterminate every last one of them. Rest assured, Arena, it will be done. Okay. I'll uh, the foul wretch. I'll hunt them down. Rest assured. If you remember, we were going. Uh, I believe it's Castle Moor. We were asked to deliver a letter to Arena's father. And. He said he couldn't do that because of duty. Then we we killed the beguiling, the misbegotten, beguiling misbegotten, or I, I don't remember the name. The lion creature with a giant sword. We killed them, and we got the Mourn Blade. And when we went back, and he said, "Oh, hey, you know, my duty's done. I can go to my daughter. His daughter has been killed, as you can see." And he's saying, "That's." You know, I, I shouldn't have chosen duty over my daughter. What was, what was I thinking? Uh, I hear this isn't the end of it. It's not the end of, of the... Ooh, what's that? It's not the end of, of the quest. I just want a little bit more. Where he goes mad. So oh, now all y'all, all y'all, uh, clamoring up, right? Now that I beat your big, beat the big dog, everybody clamoring up. Okay, okay, great. So he's going to kill all these guys. He had real big hearts not too long ago, but. Walk through that and let that disappear. We beat. Was it Margaret? The Foul Omen? And, uh. I. I don't think I'm strong enough to beat Godric. So, I'm mean, going around trying to power up in my spare time. Uh, off screen. Uh, again, I want to point out that originally I had uh, just two scimitars. Now, in, in my left hand, you see I have an Uchi Katana. Miss me, miss me. There you go. Die! Right. And it's a bleed. It's a bloody Uchi Katana, but I did some adventure. You can see in the little corner right there, it's got this kind of skill that some of the some of the guys have been using to to actually hack away at bosses because it, it's really good. You it costs you a little bit of blood, but it does a lot of damage. Um, I also in my right hand I have the meteoric ore blade, and power stancing it, it's it's a powerful thing. Like I, I love the 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 way things are depicted when you're fighting with the two swords. I almost want to say it reminds me of Roni Kenshin. Just a little bit. But there you go. So. Uh, this doesn't tell you where to go. Like It just says go to Stormvale. And that's about it. And it gives like I, I as you can see on the map I've been adventuring around uh, just trying to find different places to because there's a, a bunch of optional bosses in this game and I love it uh, just to see where I can go and get stronger before I actually try to attack the story because I'm one of those types of guys that do like all the side quests before I even start to go to the, the main story and I do that because by the time I start actually doing the main story, I want to be able to breeze through. I want to feel powerful. And I've, I said, I've 
pretty sure I said that before. That I do want to feel powerful. That's why I am using the and I'm dual wielding katanas, but because of the bleed factor, and when you hit someone enough, you bleed out. Would whether it be bosses or or just regular enemies, you bleed them out, and that takes a huge chunk off their their lives, a, a big percentage, and that it does make me feel powerful. Like I've seen people with big bleed builds, and I, I'm pretty sure I'm doing it wrong. Um, not leveling up my stats right. I haven't figured everything out. I, I'm probably going to. Tr I'm going to try, to be honest. But once I get everything figured out, I'll probably do a second playthrough just for you know for my own enjoyment. Start off as a, a samurai this time. Forced to dismount. Oh, 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 you follow me in here? Man, you're dodging. Like, what are you, dick face? Take that. Yeah. Go down this elevator shaft here. It is grace. from Castle Morn. Oh, never mind. He's on me. He's on me. Take that. <clears throat> and you just die there. I don't little ugly bird monster thing. There's more down there. Just hacking away at something. I don't, I don't know. So we're gonna try and do this Sekiro style. Ninja style. Ha! Can't, can't get up there. I don't feel like jumping. This thing, this whole game gives me anxiety. Like, what if I fall? What if I mess up? Whatever. But yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one that feels that way. And I'm not fighting on. Up. Oh. Missed. Missed. And you're going over there. Hop up and come on. And you do the same thing your friend did. And I'm getting you get cut down just like your friend did. And now I'm back to my anxiety. And there's a some kind of stone miner up there. I'm debating on what if I want to. Screw with him. I don't trust my skills. It didn't it. My jumping skill, my platforming skills, I don't I don't trust them just yet. Shank. Back, tally ho. I had somebody comment that uh, my guy was the king of the Ottoman Empire. With his clothes looking Middle Eastern, him being uh, African of uh, African descent, and then wielding two katanas. Two, uh, I keep saying katanas, but I'm pretty sure the, the correct plural of it is still just katana. So, as I had never heard of that before, I actually looked up Ottoman Empire. You get shanked. Yeah, you too. Is there another one? Yep. There you go. There you go. Why do you guys keep jumping? I, I, I can't say anything. Because jumping or not, I, I prefer they jump that way. When they jump, I can just knock them back. So I can take your stuff. Look 
around real quick. Still take your stuff. Creep, creep, snoop, snoop, Sekiro style. Can I do this? And not other others. That is my biggest thing. Alright, alerted you. And stab you in the back. Stay down, my friend. Stay down. That's what Ninja Ninja said. He did yet. You dead yet? I think you can see that uh, Afro Samurai is actually one of my favorites concerning the fact that he's it's part of my uh, it's part of my intro. When Afro Samurai came out, I, I was amazed, astonished, thrilled, and overjoyed because that, I love for one, I love the, uh, the animation quality. Too. Uh, being black myself, I haven't seen a lot of things. I'm not saying they aren't out there. I'm just saying I haven't seen a lot of things where you know black characters are black people as main characters. I loved it, especially in the voice by Samuel L. Jackson. Ew. Thought it'd be something cooler than that. I went through all that trouble for that. No. No, 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 no. Give me something better. Still doing Sekiro style. If I can get around here. Uh, yeah, screw you, hippie. Right, make you drag out. Come on, come on, come on. You can do it, you can do it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I miscalc that. Nope, nope, yeah. Okay, here we go. Shank you in the back. You need blunt weapons to really do any kind of serious damage to them. So, my striking weapons, my katana, aren't really, really good for head-to-head -head fights with them and I as of right now my stubbornness lets me, it doesn't allow me to change it like I refuse because I don't have a lot of ability to be changing weapons out like that when I say that it's, it's the equipment load I don't have a lot of that I've been putting a lot of it into the decks and the other stats needed to actually wield these these weapons So you see the bird things over there. I don't know what they're chomping at. What they're chomp uh. Ah, I messed that up. Tactical retreat. Try to draw some out. And what did I just say about them jumping? Come on, you can do it again. You stupid. Thank you. I have a feather arrow in my arm. Ah, oh, you don't dodge, you booger face, blip head brained. Really? Seriously? You know how we're doing it? Drop out from the sky. That's why you're dead. And you too. It only took me getting <laughs> dropped down on. And them hacking at me like I was whatever they were originally hacking at. So, creep, creep, snoop, snoop. Second arrow. Ha! 
Oh, 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 did not see you, did not see you. Miss, miss, miss me again. Here, yeah, yeah. okay, no. now I can fight. Take that, take that. sneaking around because we don't know around what or who is around the next corner as I was just saying could you see a guy in the, uh, around that corner right there I don't think they really bother you unless you actually start messing with them which is fair enough that's how things should be don't screw with me and I won't screw with you personal opinion but you know Ooh, what's over here Still more to get. It looks like a somber smithy. Yep. So the yellow ones are regular smithing stones, and the white stuff is somber smithing stones. And that looks like a boss fight. Boss fight, boss battle, boss, boss, boss. Before we do that, just take whatever we can get before we go up in there. Because I don't know if we're going to win. Do a little bit more exploring for, because chances are once I beat this boss, I'm just getting the heck up out of here. Figure out where we haven't been. Soft cotton. That's like that quiet spell they use. The whisper spell. Kind of like the whisper song. Wait till you see my dick. Wait till you see my dick. Oh. Then again, the whisper song is old, so how many of you guys actually remember that? I'm still skulking and stalking about, like, there's actually something here that might fight me. Then again, as I said, you never know. Time for the battle to commence. What are you doing, Gurdiman? to turn its back to me and not attack. That's how you can do the most damage. What is this? Scaly Mr. Guy. With a big, big pass. Oh, bled you out. There you go. I'm gonna anchor as a weapon and my wolves dissipated. Ooh, dissipation. So, we beat us a boss. Look around, just make sure we got everything. Looks like we did. I wonder if you can drop down from there. That's that's my question. Then looks like a big old hole. So since we beat a boss, and you know, this video is running kind of long. I just want to say thank you for watching. Uh, for those of you not subscribed, uh, you know, hit the like and subscribe button, notification button, and the bell. And because that lets me know that you guys are picking up what I'm putting down as far as content goes. And it helps push my content out to people that might not know I exist. And, you know, more people watching is always a good thing. It's free for you, but it means the entire world to me. 
you know, the HBO special, Help a Brother Out special. So, in the meantime, in between time, always with the peace signs, I'm King Sway, and I will see you guys always and forever in the next one. Later.